Okay, um, fourth axis set up. There are four screws that come in a bag that are the same. They're yay long. Two go here, two go here. These two in the back make it adjustable so you can push these and that'll stop this from moving. These two move this left and right. There are two centric spacers right there. Two longer screws um, that go on this side with the eccentrics. Um, these wheels have two um, bearings with a washer that goes in the middle, just like you put together um, your Mega V wheels here. Same idea. The washer in the center. These two are the shorter screw between these. So there's two longer and two shorter, but not as short as these. These two get just the regular spacer, not the eccentric spacer. Both, all four of these come up from the bottom. Can't put them the other way, they'll hit on the bottom here. Um, on the bottom of this, you have one, two, three, four. These two just go in to screw this down. These two go into that T-rack there. And there's two, or I don't know what you call it, T-nut, where you can put T-nuts. There's two T-nuts that go in there to hold that down. Um, you could put it in these two there, but um, you don't want to do that. Anyway, I didn't want to do that because this here lines up the center of this. If I put it over, I'd be too far this way. Um, so that takes care of these, the assembly of this, and then we've now mounted this. Now this gets four screws that are in a bag that go through this way with four nuts. Them are adjustable to make your motor adjustable to tighten your belt. Um, you have a small pulley and a big pulley. The small pulley has these two set screws also with these. Um, I took my square and squared these two pulleys up and uh, tightened this one first, brought my square over, brought this so it's in line, tightened that one. And then I just stuck a little dilly in here, tightened it the best I could. So it wasn't over tight, but tight to where it'll move. And then I tightened these four nuts. I've used Loctite on these four, the two screws underneath holding this, the four set screws I've used Loctite on. Um, <laughs> These T-nut screws I've used Loctite. I said I used Loctite on them. When I say Loctite, I mean blue Loctite. I used it on these and these. Even though these are nylon lock nuts, I'm still using it. I found that these loosen up. Uh, they're just cheap, I guess. Did not use it here or here because these are adjustable. Um, to lock this in this way. Um, that's how I set it up. Uh, motor ran the cable out the back. So, no instructions, but there you go.